Hello everybody, Christovan Hul here and welcome back to the channel. I'm back playing the early access game of Pro Wrestling Sim. So where we last left off, we trimmed down the roster, we changed it up a little bit, revamped the whole WWE, took out the brands and all that. Go check it out in the previous video. But for now, right now, we're going to be booking Monday Night Raw better so let's go ahead make raw better that's what exactly what we're going to do and uh if you see right here john laurinitis the person that we've released in the previous video joined mlw so let's go ahead and book our first monday night raw so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna do a match first we're gonna hype up the crowd for the match because before Raw would start with people talking. Right now, we're gonna have a uh, a match and let's let's make it let's make it for the 24/7 uh, title. We're gonna have at Angel Garza, our truth. Um, where is he? I can actually do this. Grand Metalik. And let's go ahead and put uh, Drew Gulak in there. A fatal foray for the WWE 24 7 title. And this is going to last nine minutes. And let's see. Who's gonna be the ref? It's gonna be John Cone. Alright. Title 24 7. Perfect match gimmick. Nope. Winner will be auto. Booking options. Um, make people laugh. No. No match purpose. We're, we are going to have the match should contain a major stunt. Yes. When have that, we're going to hype up the crowd. So, um, let's see. Garza, Garza, V, R, Truth, V, Gran Metalik, V, Drugulak. Okay. Um, we're gonna put the description. Um, Raw or new Raw, new Raw starts off with a fatal, oh, fatal four-way match for the 24/7 title to get the crowd pumped. To get the crowd pumped, perfect. Add match all right so after that we're gonna go ahead add an angle we're gonna have all the McMahons come out Mr. McMahon Shane McMahon Stephanie McMahon and for 10 minutes they're going to talk they're gonna talk and they're going the segment will be called the apology the Mc Mans come out one by one and proceed. Oh, proceed. I don't know how to spell proceed. Proceed to talk about the changes to Raw and WWE. Okay. At the end, they Apollo. Oh, let me see. We're gonna change that. Okay, change this raw and WWE. Um, raw and WWE. Um, they announce they have hired. And 
a or have given full control to a to Christopher who oh, a well well suited replacement <laughs> at the end they are the McMahons McMahons Apollo apologize vigorous vigorously vigorously with with a lot of bowing and crying Cry, crying the segment ends with them saying you are the authority saying so it ends with them saying to the crowd you are the authority and we're gonna go ahead and put that for 11 minutes there we go the apology perfect all right so let's let's do a tag team tag team match uh, teams so we gotta determine the new tag team champions and I believe the Smackdown tag team champions were the new day and the raw one was Street Profits or it's the other way around I, I forgot and we'll go ahead give them nine minutes to we'll give the tag team perfect uh, and then Scott Armstrong will be the ref and we'll do this the new day the the street profits we're gonna have it auto I don't I don't care who wins add match to show perfect okay so let's um let's cool things down with a singles match we have 51 minutes remaining so we have plenty of time let's go ahead and let's have Keith Lee face Kevin Owens for the heck of it it'll be a eight minute match Owens v Kevin Owens v Keith Lee. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Um, next, we will have an angle, and it's going to be Roman Reigns and Paul Heyman. They're going to talk about being sh or out of footing. And then their subject is going to be Drew McIntyre. There we go. And it's going to be f about seven minutes. We're going to call it Reigns Complains. Reigns complains about being stripped of the. WWE Universal title and tells Drew that he's coming for the WWE Championship all the while Paul Heyman is giving looks to Roman Reigns you know looks of admiration so it's gonna be talking there we go next match be a women's match we're gonna have a Mick we're gonna have a uh, Mick James and uh, let's see Mick James and 
Who would she work well with? Oh, Mia Yim. Ooh. Oh, but she's a heal. That's fine. Um, where's Naomi? Yes, Mickey James and Naomi versus Mia Yim. And you know what? Shayna Baszler. We're not gonna have Shayna Baszler team up with Nia Jax. Not, not, not in this row. Okay. Let's see. James and Na oh, let's do this. Mickey and Naomi v Mia and Shayna. Perfect. Okay, time book 53 minutes. Okay. So, the next thing we're going uh, to do is we're going to have a uh, a singles match. And it's going to be between the um, US champion and the Intercontinental Champion. Where is the Intercontinental? There he is. B.E. versus Bobby Lashley. Interesting. And then M oh. MVP. I gotta change his name. And Xavier Woods is going to be in Big E's corner. Good old five minute match. Big E v Bobby Lashley. And um, no title. We are going to go ahead and um, major stunt. There we go. Okay, okay. 22 minutes left. Um, let's have another angle where Oscar. Because I, I. Right here, and Sasha Banks are face to face. Um, talking about five minutes. Sasha confronts Os Oscar. I'm just making sure I spelled it correctly. So, uh, so in this segment, after being stripped of the SmackDown Women's title, Sasha confronts Asuka and gets in her face. Asuka ch challenges or offers Sasha for a title match up next. Perfect. And then we have that match. Add match. Sasha. Oscar. Seven minutes. Women's championship. Boom. Okay. So, uh, so we have the 24-7 title, the world tag team, and the women's. Okay. Um, next up will be a... Hmm. Let's showcase some teams. How about that? Let's have the uh, Forgotten Sons versus uh, the Mysterios. But we shall add some people. Um, let's go ahead and add Baron Corbin. So it's going to be a six-man tag. And who would be good with the Mysterios? <laughs> Murphy? Ooh. Yes. Murphy and the Mysterios. Versus Corbin and the Forgotten Sons. Go ahead and make it eight minutes. Uh, 
Corbin and Sons <laughs> v Murphy and the Mysterios. That's funny. Corbin and Sons. I'm honestly liking that stable. It's rather. I mean, I know they te they 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 did team up with Corbin to become the um, Knights of the Lone Wolf. But Corbin and Sons. That's hilarious. But. Either way, we're going to go ahead and have this to the show. So, the last two minutes. Uh-oh. Okay, the apology needs to go down. There we go. And uh, we're going to bring this down to five minutes because we need enough six minutes. Um... down to seven okay eight minutes eight minutes will be Roman Reigns versus Drew this is Drew Paul Heyman perfect last eight minutes and it will be for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship um, match purpose Better steal the show. We, this is the first, first the inaugural show for the better Raw, for my booking of Raw. So, um, can I do more? I can't. Okay, Roman Reigns should have an elaborate entrance. Drew McIntyre should have an elaborate entrance. Paul Heyman should have an elaborate entrance. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Heyman comes out in an elaborate entrance. I can, I can, I can picture it. Um, but uh, no, we're not going to do that. And the match should contain a major spot. And there we go. That should work out nicely. Yeah. Eight minutes. The apology is the, the biggest one. Okay. So I think we're good to go. Let's go ahead and see how well the first Raw that I booked goes. Okay, so first we have Garza VR2 versus Grand Metalik versus Drew Gulak. Let's see, Major Stunt really added to the match. Nothing bad. The crowd got... Oh, right here. New Raw starts off with a Fatal 4 match for the 24-7 title to get the crowd pumped. And looks like they were pumped. Oh no, there were moments where they. Dang. Crowd is fickle. Crowd is fickle, but we do have four stars for this match 77%. Good. Next segment The Apology 89%. People love this. The McMahons come out one by one and proceed to talk about the changes to Raw and WWE. They announce they have given full control to Christopher Von Hull, a well suited replacement. At the end, the McMahons apologize vigorously with a lot of bowing and crying. The segment ends with them saying to the crowd, You are the authority. Apparently people like that. Okay, 89%, not bad. Next match, the New Day versus the Street Profits to determine the uh, new WWE World Tag Team Champions. Let's see who wins that one. All right, and a four-star banger the audience was into it 84 percent the new day have beaten the street profits and have become the new w world tag team champions what a match okay moving on kevin owens versus keith lee one-on-one -on -one. let's see who wins that a four-star banger 84 percent audience was into it perfect Moving on, we have the angle where Reigns complains about being stripped of the championship. 96%. Nice. Reigns complains about being stripped of the WWE Universal title and tells Drew that he's coming for the WWE Championship. All the while, Paul Heyman is giving looks to Roman Reigns. You know, like hype, hype looks. Not, not sexy looks. Uh, maybe a little sexy looks. Well, we move on to a tag women's tag team match. Mickey and Naomi versus Mia and Shayna. Let's see how that does. 
77% not that bad. Three stars. Audience seemed to enjoy. That's good. Dang, the audience. The audience doesn't like like women matches. Come on now. Okay, moving on. We have Champion versus Champion Big E versus Bobby Lashley. Let's see how people like this. Four stars, 88%. The crowd was on their feet. They love this. That is that is good to hear. Okay, next we have an angle. Sasha confronts Asuka 90%. After being stripped of the SmackDown Women's title, Sasha confronts Asuka and gets in her face. Oscar offers Sasha for a title match up next. People loved it. So now, since uh, Sasha got stripped of the title, you know, it's only fair that she gets to challenge Oscar for the WWE Women's Championship. Uh, let's see how that goes. Four stars audience was into it, 82%, and it looks like Sasha Banks has defeated Oscar to become the new WWE Women's champion congrats to her okay moving on we have Corbin and Sons versus Murphy and the Mysterios let's see how that goes 72% three stars there are moments where the crowd lost interest okay that's it's too bad too bad but you know it's fine okay so we are down to the main event Roman Reigns versus Drew McIntyre to see who become WWE World Heavyweight Champion after Roman Reigns was stripped of the WWE Universal Championship. So let's see how it goes. Next segment, 97% the crowd was red hot, one and a half star though, the over level wrestling ability just wasn't there to steal the show, felt like they were aiming for something great but never quite got there. Dang, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have done that uh, steal the show. It's fine, it's fine. There was a stunt though, had a crown on the feet. Volume was struggling for breath by the end of the match. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? <laughs> Did I actually put Heyman in the match? Was this a handicap match instead of a... Instead of a singles match? Is that why Roman Reigns won? I mean, it was 90%. But uh, Roman Reigns won. <laughs> did I accidentally put Paul Heyman to compete? I think I did. Well, that's my bad. But either way, Roman Reigns is the new champion. Um, we might need to um, fix that in the next uh, booking. But either way, your new WWE World Heavyweight Champion is the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns. And so let's see how it did. Gain popularity 0 0.5, 0 0.10 in Africa. Nice. Some 90s. The biggest one was 97. Um, Reigns complains was 96. And oh, Sasha confronts Oscar was the third 90. Pretty good. Pretty good. Show rating 89%. I can I can do that. That's almost a that's a B plus. B plus player here or B plus booker good let's go ahead and end the show perfect all right so we have mail let's see summary Pens. Ooh, not bad let's see is that more or less that is more also in ticket sales perfect Let's see how our money is going. Not too bad. Okay, so I'm gonna simulate all the way to Monday. Let's see. So this will be Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. There we go. I am gonna auto book superstars. Just cause. Auto book. Go ahead. Perfect. Start show. Four star match, three star match, three star, 83%, 100%, interesting, Edge, and Roman Reigns, okay, and a, uh, the Vikings parents versus the Street Profits to end the show, oh, no, R-Truth versus Bobby Lashley to end the show, interesting, 
79%, not bad. Like I said, I'm not I'm not booking uh, Superstars or SmackDown. They're more of enhancement shows, uh, to be honest. Okay, so SmackDown, auto book, go ahead. Jay Uso is unhappy with this segment. Okay, we can't have that, so we'll auto book again. No unhappiness. Good. What is wrong? Oh, okay. I'm way over by seven minutes. Um, we can change that. Three minutes. Okay. Change this to ten. There we go. All right. Uh, I can't. There we go. That was weird. They they need to fix that. Again, this is early access, so they need to fix that. So let's go ahead and start the show. 92. 93. Three stars. As long as nobody switches titles, because all title switches will be on Raw. Perfect. 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 RK Bro vs. The New Day. And Sami Zayn vs. Drew McIntyre to end the show. Ooh, gained popularity. Not in America, though. That's fine. It's all about Monday Night Raw. Honestly. Alright, 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 alright. New Japan Pro Wrestling. Do, 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 do. Oh, mail. I got some mail. Summary of Superstars. Not bad. Ooh, the same amount. Hurrah and SmackDown. Okay. Are we dipping? Are we... We're alright with, with money. Okay. So, uh... Sunday? Monday. There we go. Alright. So, when's our next pay-per-view? <laughs> By the way, Elimination Chamber? No, Royal Rumble. No. Yep, yep, Royal Rumble. Royal Rumble is our next uh, pay per view. So, um, looking at the time I have for recording, what we're going to do is we're going to leave uh, this episode for now. We're not going to book another one. Um, but I am going to do some cosmetic things. Uh, before we end the uh, video. So, let's see all promotions. World Wrestling Entertainment. I want to get rid of people. Maybe. Oh, MVP. I gotta change MVP's name. There we go. Change it to boop. 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 There we go. I don't need those dots. Okay, roster. Nope. Uh, promotions, there we go. Alright. Let's... Let's send Booker T. Booker T and Mark and Mark Henry and Stephanie to NXT. So Booker T sent to developmental. Mark Henry sent to developmental. And Stephanie so she can be with her husband. There you go. Miss. Um okay. So, let's see what we have now. I might send these to ref. John, Ayers, and Sean. Jason, or Jason and Sean. Jason. And the developmental. And Sean. And to developmental. Perfect. Okay. 
that should be good to go. Do we want to bring anyone from the Fat Mental to uh, WWE? Not yet. I think not yet because I think we have a lot of people already. Um, let's go ahead and check that. Let us check that. Yeah, honestly, I think I think we're good with people for now. Um, yeah, I'm just looking at everyone to see if I want to hire or fire anybody. But I think I'm good. I might send Jeff Hardy to... Send to... NXT, so you can, uh, you know, still be relevant, but I don't want to deal with that marijuana stuff. Alright, so, let me check on my titles. I mean, I can do it, I can do it here, and I can also check right here. Titles, and El Garza is still 24-7 champion. Vicky is still Intercontinental. Bobby Lashley is still US. Sasha Banks. Oh, beat Asuka. Uh, Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston became the new champions. Um, and Roman Reigns and Paul Heyman. Oh my god. Okay, um, let me fix this up a little bit. <laughs> Roman Reigns and Paul Heyman. That's hilarious. Okay. Oh no. That is, that is funny. Okay. Okay, I gotta do some things. Um. I'm gonna see something. Uh, if I can do this. In state. This is just a test. I'm going to deactivate it. Can I give this to anybody? No, I cannot. Retire. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, so I'm going to fix everything. I'm going to have to skip a day and book this event, but you're not going to see it. And then I'm going to skip to the Raw after. That's what I'm going to do, because um, I got I to gotta fix some things. Okay, so something's happened. Becky Lynch was hit with an injury uh, while I was trying to fix things, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, no word on no word yet on how long that is and Drew Gulak wants to work with Mustafa Ali and also in the news Right here Britt Baker and Adam Cole announced their engagement Good for them Okay back to fixing the universe All right Okay All right, okay, so Everything is right with the world again. Uh, if we look here, roster. Nope. Oh, it's better. It's better viewed here. As you can see, everything is right with the world. And Garza is the 24/7 uh, champion once again. Big E's the champion. Bobby Lashley is the champion as well. Sasha Banks uh, is champion after Asuka. Roman Reigns is champion after Drew. After Roman Reigns and Paul Heyman. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Um, and the New Day are still tag team champions. Okay. So, everything is right with the world. Um... This is where we start. Roman Reigns, champion. Flash Banks, 
champion, Lashley, Big E. So, I'm gonna leave the video here. We will continue with another booking after I fixed everything. And we'll probably flesh out some storylines, maybe some rivalries, and see where everything goes. So, for now, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, hit that like button. Subscribe for more awesome content. And I'll see you in the next game. Christovan, who out.